Hi friends, it's Auntie Cuckoo. I am back in the Dollar Tree looking at all kinds of school supplies today and I'm bringing you with me. Let's go shopping. So this store has a lot of hair accessories out. Definitely, I'm thinking back to school. Cute little star-shaped brushes. And I think these are cute. The little combs with the pom-poms. Those are great for little backpacks. Really cute. Lots of clips and bows, scrunchies, even some in fur. I don't know about your guys' area, but here where I live, kids will go back to school partially, but a lot of it's gonna be done online, but you always need school supplies, so let's take a look. Over here they have more back to school organization. So these are smaller than the ones that I've showed you guys in Target Dollar Spot, but they're only a dollar. They are calling them book bins though, instead of um, sort of vertical hanging file holders. They have some clear storage. So lots of purple or pink and green. I actually have one of these in clear and I keep my sewing kit in it. They have the miniature caddies. So bright blue, really bright pink, sort of a muted rose or purple almost, and green. Up here they have the storage trays in three packs. Some fun acrylic magnetic, well they say boxes, but they're more of little circles. So purple and gray and pink. And then these that are new activity trays and they come in all kinds of colors. So I always try and buy my Expo dry erase markers here. They're a good buy. They have a bunch of different colors. And then if you have kids who use whiteboards, you can get eight of the Jot markers. And also in all black, an eight count. I also have this one with a few colors and mostly black. They also have some back to school planners, little student planners that I think are really cute. It's actually really handy even if you're not in school. A few different prints I wanted to show you guys. I thought this one was super cute. They do have all of their Sharpies out. Ton of different colors, pink, orange, black, purple, red, are just a few of the colors I'm seeing. Now, from memory, because my kids no longer use crayons, you can get a much better deal places like Target and Walmart than one pack for a dollar. But these are kind of fun in the glitter, and they do have a really good deal over here. I want to show you guys. Of course, some fun pins. Totally not necessary, but definitely a lot of fun. This one with the googly eyes is really funny. This is what caught my eye brand name. It's only a four pack, but they are pre-sharpened and I have sharpened a lot of pencils for teachers. I'm sure they'd appreciate that if they're doing classroom donations. They also have the 10 pack of the Papermate mechanical pencils. I already have these in my buggy. Over here they have some more mechanical pencils. These are the soft scripts. This one's got some flame detail. I'm going to pick up this one with the sketches on it. I think that's really pretty. So down below, I want to show you guys, they do have some fun clipboards. They do have the plain press board ones, but this one in the colorful hearts I thought was super pretty. And this one in kindness matters. I will say it's definitely more of like a cardboard feel. Up here they have all kinds of pencils. So over here they have some 0.7 lead. That's actually a pretty good price to get it at. And then these, I always pick up sharpeners for the kids. And these come with some eraser heads, so that's nice. They also have some fun erasers. Got rainbows, really cute little pineapple, a unicorn and a donut. Then of course, the regular erasers and some scented ones. Those are a lot of fun. This is a good buy, but these don't last if your kids have to carry a stapler in their backpacks. They have the glue sticks in the eight pack and Westcott scissors. It's a really good buy. It's a name brand. A lot of my scissors are by Westcott and you guys 
kind of a scissor hoarder. This door is hanging things really high, so I am scanning up to show you guys the suction pencil holders. I've seen a lot of people share these and they're using them in their bathrooms, which is brilliant. On the mirrors, they apparently just suck right on and you can put different toothpaste and toothbrushes in them so you can color code them for your kids. That's really handy. And then some rollers. The acrylic pack is a three pack and the wood in a two pack. Down here they've got all kinds of notebooks. And this is something I've bought before for my kids. Index cards if they're gonna have to do any kind of memorization. And these are nice because they have the little dividers. They have the jaw pencils in a 24 pack. Down here, all kinds of different dry erase boards. Some come with markers and some don't. So this one's got a little bit of a print around it, a bit bigger. I'm trying to not glare you guys with the plastic on that. I have the Elmer's glue and the jaw glue that is eight ounces. And then over here, they have a few pencil cases and a few different patterns and prints. These are handy even for travel. I like to pick them up sometimes, throw them in a suitcase full of all kinds of stuff. You don't want to get loose. They have the compass and protractor combos, and these are just fun. I think every kid should have a big calculator growing up. They have the clear pencil binder pouches in all kinds of polka dots, green and pink, orange and blue and these that are a lot of fun. These are also little pencil pouches. They've got powder blue, the purple with the kitty, really cute pink pig, and the dinosaur. Down here they have all kinds of pencil boxes, a few solid colors with some glitter to them, and then these that I think came out last year in the pink, the darker turquoise, sort of a minty green, and purple. They have the magnetic clips and the locker mirrors in pink, black, sort of a turquoise or teal and purple. I'm gonna show you guys these. I have gotten them for my kids before. They're not necessary, but they're a lot of fun. They're just little pencil grips with all kinds of little texture to them. And they also have some post-it notes and you get 176 for a dollar. Over here, they have the five subject divider tabs lots of filler paper in 200 sheets and lots of binders now i will say i do spend money on binders i tend to get really heavy duty ones because my kids trash them but these are actually really nice they do feel a little sturdier than years past in the printed ones and i'm also noticing that they have some 1.5 inch binders which i haven't seen these big ones before in the back to school stuff a few more prints the surfer that one's super cute oh this one is soccer I really like the chevron and they have pink leopard or cheetah I'm not sure yeah I'm definitely really liking these printed binders they do feel so much more sturdy I wanted to show you guys a close-up of a few of them so that was the print on the inside which is really cute this is the front I also have this one in sort of a camo and then this one in guitars with a peace sign so I want to show you guys this little end cap of centicorns these are scented pens 10 different color ink they have the eight count markers a few different options in the pens little notebooks and some gel pens and markers so they've got another aisle we'll take a look at and then we'll look around the rest of the store I wanted to see this that is really cute now these are the very floppy binders they have the solid colors and then a few prints that's super cute blues and greens race car shine the sloth oh that's cute just found this one in the controllers that is super cute and they have some leaves and that heart print over here they have more pencil pouches super cute puppies down here they have two kitties as well and some glitter options 
of the binders and a few characters. So this is a lot of fun. Definitely <laughs> bringing back some memories. My Little Pony. They have Hero Time, Mulan, and Rapunzel. And then some Transformers, Toy Story, and these in the clear. And those come in all kinds of colors. Down here they have a few different printed portfolio folders. These are great for when the kids have little reports due. I like to get them in the multi-pack and have them on hand if they need them. Just pay attention because this is a two-pack, this is a three-pack. Definitely want to get your money's worth. And they have my favorite all-time Dollar Tree product, these calendars. I have this on my refrigerator. I refer to it every day. It's time to pick up another one. Over here they have all kinds of composition books, but these are catching my eye. They're so cute with their roller skate. They've got that one, they've got a cactus, a few colorful versions, oh hey, on the blue. But this one, I think, is definitely gonna be the most popular. Super cute print. Over here they have a few two-pack of the pencil cases. Definitely a very thin nylon. One is smaller than the other, so if that is something that interests you, keep an eye open for them. Come in a few different prints, including my favorite. This end cap is full of more organization. They have the mini drawers in blue, pink, and green. Now, I picked these up in the years past for my kids to put little trading cards in, hair clips, and rubber bands. They also have the locker style bins that are dry erase compatible, some clear acrylic organizers, and I think these might be two different sizes. Down here they have the larger baskets. I remember these in my teacher's classrooms for turning in all my homework. Over here in what I like to call the teacher section, they have some things that I'm seeing for the first time. These are really cute sharpeners, actually, that are Seuss. There's thing one and thing two. Dr. Seuss. These are a lot of fun. Some building shapes. Some counting chips. The tweezers. And this is some room decor in Seuss. Over on a decor round, they have some fall decor starting to roll out. They have these standing pumpkins that they put out the last few years. Some boxed signs. So I do remember picking this one up last year. They also put it out in a green backing this year. And this one in orange. Down here they have some standing pumpkins. The raffia is so big you can't even see the stem, but it comes in three colors. And then they've got these mini signs. Let me move stuff around to show you. So it looks like they have four different signs. This one in Welcome Fall has the gingham in brown. And they have Hello Autumn. I think this one is my favorite. With the yellow leaves. And Be Grateful with the red gingham. And then Harvest Blessings with the wood trim. Over here they have a few mini succulent candles that are really cute I wanted to show you guys. Now let's take a look at the other side. Starting to bring out their ceramic pumpkins. So they have three different versions in these. And then I'm really liking these. These are new this year. They do have a little bit of an embossed leaf. I just wish their stem was brown. But they have it in the green and the darker orange some of the glass pumpkins we've seen in the last few years. And down here, some new initial pumpkins. So they do have it in sort of a natural and an orange. I'm seeing a few letters, A, B, C, S, and a lot of Ks, one L and one J. They have some really pretty candles with some rose gold lids. So this one is the Orchid and Black Current. Honey, Blossom and Amber, Violet and Iris. I think these may have been out for summer. They come in Eucalyptus and Chamomile, Garden Lily and Pomegranate Citrus. Some bright glass votives. 
Then we'll take a look at this aisle, which is all of their frames. See if we can find any decor. Got a few more candles I wanna show you guys. The melon ice, a peaches and cream, and raspberries. And I really like these. There is a dark gray one in the back there. But I'm seeing some peach, blue, green, and clear. And I don't think I've seen these, although I haven't been doing a ton of shopping. Ooh, they have some wax melts. That one's hanging open. It's hot apple pie and cranberry mandarin. Oh, I thought those were pumpkins. I got overly excited. They do have some floating candles. Some more pretty votives over here. So this store has a very large frame aisle. So there's good and bad with that. They have a lot to choose from, but it can get very messy very quickly. So I'm noticing they're putting their canvases in some clear plastic. I think that's nice. It does give a glare though. So I'm gonna show you guys a few of them. Brush your teeth. That is really cute for a bathroom. Forever blessed with every breath. That's really cute. Lots in floral with sayings. This one, some blues. Really pretty horse. Oh, that's cute. That's a little washing machine. Walk by faith. Gather. My gray heart. Live every moment. Wash and rinse. Over here, they have a few things I haven't seen before. Some little standing dinosaur decor that's a mirror. And then they have some butterfly cutout decor. A few different colors. Sparkle every day with some glitter love that and down here for the kiddos some really cute little animal decor the fox and the frog over here there's a few new things and we don't get a lot of the really fun and exciting makeup items but they have some hard candy I'm thinking these are bronzers a few different colors in those and this that is a metallic mousse, and that's also by Hard Candy. They have some new Bolero sheet masks. So they've got strawberry seed, banana, lotus flower, but that smells really good. And the geranium, and they're just the little sheet masks. They also have the Bolero cleansing facial balm. This is really nice packaging. I haven't seen them do that before. Down here they have more items in Banana Blast by Bolero, some Superberry, and looks like we may have missed out on a lot of the avocado. This is one of our food aisles, and I just spotted some Lucky Charms. It is gluten-free, and it is 10.5 ounces. So I'm over in the kitchen aisle, and I just spotted something to share with you guys. I don't know if these were from last year or they're just out early here but there's only two of the oven mitts this one is so pretty and the pumpkins and then they have this one that's more fall pot holders just a couple more things I want to show you guys over here on the dish aisle they put out some new acrylic drinkware in the dark orange and clear they do have some in red as well a very good size nice heavy duty acrylic and down here they have some water bottles that say cold drink on the front they're BPA free and come in the clear pink blue and green teal <laughs> comment down below what is this color they are a nice heavy plastic and have handles perfect for kids so I hope you guys enjoyed seeing what was new at this Dollar Tree Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you back very soon. Mm -hmm.